URO 10855 Major John Stephen Oroka You are sentenced to dismissal from the Defense Forces uh, URO 09572 Major Patrick Zadok Abol You are sentenced to dismissal from the Defense Forces You saw so that at base camp Somalia this 11th day of November 2023 under my hand and seal of this court. Uh, I'm Brigadier Robert Freeman Mugabe, uh, the Chairman General Court Marshal. It informs all officers and militants that uh, no one is above the law. And once there is evidence to prove the case, uh, the courts of law takes its course, whether you are a senior or not. Uh, from the evidence that was brought before the court, a poor command and control was one of the major factors, but there were other factors as well. A failure to protect raw materials include losing arms and ammunition, illegal possession of ammunition, failure to do any act necessary to protect arms and ammunition, among others. Uh, we have had and concluded six cases. Uh, the seventh one will be uh, concluded when we go back. Uh, but considering the seven cases now had uh, for this time we have been around, uh, the crime rate is very low compared to the number of forces that are in the mission area. Uh, for example, uh, I'm now one and a half years in the, this in the office, but this is the first time we are coming to, 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 to the mission area uh, for the same purpose. So that means uh, the rate is very low. The rate of crime is very low. Uh, the commanders, of course, should be selected according to the command capabilities. And even commanders should be able to train with their soldiers so that they can build the cohesion and teamwork while in the mission area. Uh, my final word about this is that, uh, as I said, no one is above the law. There is need to be disciplined while we are serving our country. Uh, as, uh, standing operating procedures, uh, rules of engagement, and other guidance that is put in place should be strictly observed so that we avoid uh, being caught on the wrong side of the road.